Hi YouTube, um, a long time since I did any emblem of any description, the last one I did was Carl Pilkington, that was Black Ops 1, I'm about to show you a Carl Pilkington Black Ops 2 emblem. Uh, I spent ages on this yesterday getting it right, it's quite hard to take away some of the tools that we started with last time, so I've, I've done it, um, I'm quite happy with it, let's see what you think. Right, so I'm going to start with a full circle, I'm going to fill that to the size of the box and I'll make that dark blue and that's slot one slot two another circle reduced in size and I'll make that a light blue slot three a circle again reduced again a bit smaller this time black. Slot 4, you want a curved line. Actually, forget slot 3, that doesn't need to be a circle. Slot 3 needs to be the curved line. Reduce that, put that right to the side for now. Right hand side and make that black. Layer 4, Curved line, rotated, reduced, left hand side, black. Next layer, curved line, rotated, just inside the last black hand side, on the right hand side, and make that a pink. Any pink you want, but I like the light, uh, lighter pink. So I mean, that's the way that car should look. Then same again, left hand side, made pink. Then you want to go and get your black circle, reduce it down so that you can still see these bits on the outside, and of course black. Layer 8, smaller circle. already you can see it's starting to come together. I'm just going to make his ears, which are what the curved lines are, slightly bigger. Obviously you'll do this yourself. This is only a quick. I'll show you what my finished one looks like because this won't turn out as well because of the amount of time I'm going to have to spend on it. Right, next up. Circle again. A lot of circles. Reduced in size just under middle, they've got these lines on now, so just under the centre spot, black. Circle again, inside your black circle, just to leave a decent outline. Sorry for the camera by the way guys, I've not even got my webcam anymore, this is using a, my phone. Right, so pink inside the black. Then you want to get, what did I use for this? I think it was that. So you want that half shuriken. Reduce that down and we're just going to block off practically the bottom left hand quarter of the circle. Make that pink. I think his nose is too big actually so I'm going to reduce that down now. Something like that. Layer 12. We use... What do we use? Flag no wind, I believe. That way around. And that is the bridge, so the bottom bit of his nose, that forms a bridge to his mouth. So that's black. Layer 13. You want the same piece, if I can find it. Right, 
not this to be flesh colored. And then, oh, what am I? Don't like this new system. Sorry if I'm taking a while, guys, but as with most of you, I'm sure I'm still getting used to this new Black Ops. It's a bit big, so reduce that down, move it up. Reduce that piece with it. So then you've got his nose down into his bridge. Now the mouth on this one's actually quite tricky. Last time I just used a sideways horseshoe, but of course there's no horseshoe on this. So I think I started with a visor. Shrink that down. Tilt it slightly and put it into place. I actually need to flip that as well, so it needs to be... I don't know if you can see that very well on my phone. I'm not even looking at it because I have to prop it up. You gotta make that black. Something like that. Slot six is our friend curved line. Reduce down. And placed on the end. Next lot, next one. I think I used the quarter circle. Reduce that right down. And that fits at the bottom, and there you can see his lip. There you go. So you've got the nose into the bridge, into his mouth. I've actually just decided that these aren't low enough, so I'm going to lower everything down slightly. You just mess around with it, get it how you like it, guys. This is my version, I think it's pretty cool when it's done. Alright, and then they've got rid of oval wide, so we've had to do round eyes this time, which I'm not the biggest fan of, but I'll make do. Obviously black. I still think his nose is too big, actually, now I've done that. So I'll just reduce his nose size again. Oh, uh, not his head. Something like that. And his eye. You want bang in the middle of the centre grid marks. And another eye. Make it the same size. Like that, eyebrows. I get the lampshade, flip it upside down, oh no, right way up, tilt it, make it black, and do the same again for his other eye. Shade again, he's going to block off his eyebrow. So, obviously, that needs to be skin colored. Eyebrows are too big, actually, so I'm going to reduce them. See he's coming together now. Then you just want to make more circles. These want to be black. You can get his hair in this time if they've allowed extra layers. So small black circles. And 
that's the rest of your layers now is just to whack in some of Carl's hair. Keep going until you finish. Sorry, this is going to be a bit boring for everyone who's watching. So this isn't going to be perfect guys, but I've not really learned how to do it immaculately myself yet. I'll show you my finished one after this, which is going to be better than this one, but this one will give you all the idea and it tells you the pieces that you need to put him together. Last piece of hair. Little bold man can come back. Brilliantly. Right, at this stage you can pick what you want to do. I mean, I think most of his hair is a bit too big, so I can reduce those down. Like that. I think his eyes are actually a bit too big, so I'm going to make his eyes slightly smaller. His nose. Is his nose. I think his nose is alright. I think the outside blue layer I'm going to change to a slightly lighter dark blue. Like that. So there you go. I think you can see that okay. There's Carl Black Ops 2. Let me just back out. I'll discard those. Here's my finished one, look. That's what I've done with him. I think it's a really good one. I'd probably prefer it to the Black Ops 1 one. If you've seen that, let me know what you think. Um, but yeah, there you go. Quick video. If any of you make it, I'll be over the moon. If you don't like it, let me know. Um, last time we had a few copycat videos come after mine. I don't think it was ever beaten. My Black Ops 1 emblem, but I would love to see if someone can beat this. There's more layers you might be able to, but I think that is pretty impressive. Um, if I do say so myself, let me know what you guys think. Cheers, thanks for watching.